Alright, so what you're looking at here is a t official tweet from Niantic stating, We're on a quest to catch three billion Pokemon in one week, and we're going to need your help. So this has brought my plans to a halt, because I was about to start fin editing... Uh, was actually going to probably be later in tomorrow's episode, but it was yesterday. But I saw this as I started to edit, and I was like, what is going on? So we're going to go over to the official Niantic uh, Pokemon Go page, and we're going to see what's up. So, Pokemon Go, Travel, and the Global Catch Challenge. And they have a YouTube uh, video. We might watch that. It looks like Pokemon Go Holly is there, and uh, some interesting uh, thumbnail edits. Trainers. Ever since Pokemon Go launched, we've loved hearing stories about trainers venturing abroad and playing together with new friends from different countries. That's what inspired us to create Pokemon Go Travel, a new video series to see the world through the eyes of a Pokemon trainer. To kick things off, Pokemon Go Travel is taking a diverse group of trainers from around the world to Japan to host our first ever, first ever Global Catch Challenge. Join us as we discover new places, meet new people, and work together in an attempt to catch 3 billion Pokemon in just 7 days. Play along with those 3 trainers as they learn more about Japanese culture, inspire the world to play together, and update you on the most amazing rewards the community unlocks along the way. And uh, here's their picture. Let's see. So very similar to Pokemon Go Fest. Uh, bronze is 500 million catches, you get double XP and 6 hour lures and more Pokemon appearing globally. Silver, 1.5 billion. Pretty big jump there. Uh, six hour lures, double XP, double Stardust. Very cool. Even more Pokemon appearing. And gold, which is really exciting. Uh, three billion catches, double XP, six hour lures, double Stardust, and Farfetch'd available worldwide for 48 hours, and Kangaskhan available in East Asia for 48 hours. Okay, because they normally get far-fetched, so they're going to get something, too. Okay, that's that's cool. That's cool. Um, stock up on Pokeball trainers. On Pokeballs. Um, the Global Catch Challenge starts now and concludes with a special celebration in Pokemon Go Safari Zone. So maybe something very similar to Pokemon Go Fest where they dropped Lugia and Articuno. Hopefully they drop Ho-Oh there and release it everywhere in the world because Niantic? Um... We can't wait to take you along on this adventure. Uh, hear what you think about Pokemon Go Travel Tour. We'll be posting daily updates on Rachel, Tiffany, Gabby, and Leon's adventures. Those Pokemon trainers from earlier. And uh, are curious to see your updates too on a trip, visiting a new part of town. Share your hashtag Pokemon Go Travel Story with us this week on your favorite social media channels, the Pokemon Go team. So this is very cool actually. Um, we might as well uh, get some first impressions here. Pokemon Go Travel. We're announcing Pokemon Go Travel the seven. first ever Global Catch Challenge. Help us catch three Pokemon billion Master Pokemon. Holly. Three billion. Hi, Mignon. Three billion Pokemon. Is that James? Seven days. Three billion. Set Gius. The more we catch, the more rewards we unlock for everyone. Pokemon no hasho chida. Nihon kara otodoke shimasu. And everyone's invited. And we need help from trainers around the world to catch three billion Pokemon. See you there. Museum of Spawn. See you there. See you there. See you there. Okay, so See you there in the game. Hey, reversal. Okay. Okay. I'm going to stop screen recording because my phone is going to run out of space, and then I'll continue talking about this. Alright, so that was actually a fairly cool video, actually. Sorry. Um, a fairly cool video. I like the fact that they used new trainers. Uh, beyond just the regular kind of faces that everybody knows, they used some new ones. Um, which is very cool. Uh, it kind of diversifies the Pokemon Go YouTuber kind of community. Uh, as far as the actual event goes, it's kind of like uh, giving us an event without giving us an event. Because we were all looking forward to um, maybe a full week of Double Stardust or Double XP or both. Um, instead, we're, we're getting this opportunity. Uh, basically, seven days you catch as many Pokemon as you possibly can, uh, which is kind of what we've been doing whenever, you know, an event wasn't going on anyway. 
uh, just now we're giving kind of a purpose. So seven days to catch as many Pokemon as you can, and you can get a possibly really great two days of Pokemon Go. Um, but the way they timed it all is probably the coolest thing of all, because they have it not only tied in tied into the Safari Zone in Totori, um, but at the end of the November like 26th range, you get two more days of. Uh, you get two days of amazing spawns, and then not too long after that is the start of December. And in December, we get Gen 3. So it's a great way to kind of get at least, well, hopefully some better spawns because more Pokemon appearing. But if we do get to gold, hopefully, we get Farfetch'd, and East Asia, who usually gets Farfetch'd, gets Kangaskhan. So that's very cool. And uh, yeah, I do like this event. Uh, I think it's kind of it's a cheeky way of giving an event without giving an event, like I said, because um, we're only going to be getting two days of an actual event, which I'm not sure how I feel about that. But hopefully they do drop Ho-Oh at the end um, for a tutorial and then bring it out to the rest of the world like uh, GoFest did with Lugia and Articuno. And uh, yeah, that those are my thoughts on the video. This will go out first, and then either tomorrow. Or the next day is going to be the a uh, trip out to City Place and Clematis uh, for kind of a pretty interesting day. I didn't do what I expected to do, but I did do something pretty cool. So stay tuned for that episode. And if you did like this one, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button. If you're enjoying the series, please subscribe. And as always, God bless, and see you for another episode of Pokemon Go.